And we're off. This is the second leg, the second and final leg of this playoff to get into the last 16 of the Sudamericana. Estudiantes de la Plata, Barcelona of Guayaquil. Barcelona winning 2-1 the first game. So Estudiantes needing at least one goal difference to take it to penalties or two goals to make it straight. Chanting the entire time, be it for Estudiantes or any other team. Chance for a long distance shot from Corozo. Roheiser, nice getting past Corozo, crosses, the ball was in the area, but it goes out. Mauro Mendes, the Uruguayan forward. Ball flying in, doesn't get all the way in there, but it does it. for the Argentine team. Couldn't be a better beginning for the Argentines here in La Plata. Initially, the corner from Rollheiser hadn't make, really made it to even the first post, but it slowly and surely got to the number 16, Mauro Mendes. Straight down the middle, ball was meant for uh, Rollheiser. Fidel Martinez connecting Corozo. He has control with his chest, but good defending by the back line of Estudiante Santiago Nunez. The number four, only 23 years of age, came up from the junior teams. Slowly moving to the area, Guido Carrillo. Mauro Mendes as well, but then Godoy, he's in there. He tried to get a final pass to somebody. He wanted the call, didn't get it. Raul Heiss on the ball, comes the cross. Headed away by Quinones. Quinones there again, and Berlaza. Godoy, moving around inside of that area. Plenty of players from Estudiantes. Carrillo. Benjamin Rawheiser. Jorge Rodriguez sending it forward. Long shot, goal! Mauro Mendes gets a brace! A brace for Estudiantes here in La Plata! What a great first half for the Pinchas! For the teams from La Plata! for these players who have been dominating Barcelona, and if things stay the same, they are through without penalties. Really early to say that, but check out the plays. Really, really well done from Estudiantes, and what a header. Great header. Godoy just sent that one in. Perfectly to Mauro Mendes, 24-year-old Uruguayan, making all the difference. Only almost 27 minutes played. Guido Carrillo gets a shot. Was it Guido Carrillo? Guido Carrillo actually went down. That was Zapiola. Zapiola with the outside of the driveboard needs to get it right into the penalty spot-ish. Fidel Martinez, another corner for Barcelona. I do not think we'll have a lot of injury time added here at the end of the first half. Zapiola, nice dribbling skills, sending it to Carrillo. Carrillo to Rojaiser, Rojaiser dangerous to the left. Oh, goal for What a game for the Pinchas! 
Edwards from the south side of Buenos Aires, Argentina. 3-0 here. And Estudiantes in the driving seat, earning themselves a spot in the final, the last 16 of the Copa Sudamericana. But there's still a whole second half left. But what a nice goal by Benjamin Rojaisen. No chance for Javier Buray, the keeper of Barcelona. And even Hanek Corosa could get uh, head on that ball. Nice move. Back there defending Carrillo. It's the ball away. Now Lucas Sosa, ball sent in. Pressure from Barcelona. Guy board still on the ball, sends it low. Damian Diaz getting ready to step on the pitch. We will see how that affects the match here in La Plata. Second half starting now. We're off here with the second 45 minutes. My name is Beer Brazil, and this is a battle in the Copa Sudamericana. Carrillo on the ball. And he stole the ball. He needs a little bit of support. Try to back heel again. And it's to the end of inside of the area. Carrillo! Estudiantes here in La Plata. Good sequence of plays, well worked. The assist from Mauro Mendes, who scored two goals. Zapiola providing the pass, and Mauro Mendes the assist. Carrillo didn't even hit his foot. It did not even hit his foot. Hit his shin before going in. Estudiantes up to no good against Barcelona, but this time... That's some strong marking from Estudiantes. They're not giving the Barcelona guys a lot of room. Fidrizewski, chance for Barcelona! Pinatares was there, tried to hit it with the outside of that left foot, but the ball goes straight out. Vidrizevsky just finding the number 20 going into the area without marking. Long high ball, Godoy, Godoy! Hitting the outside of the net, the right back. Check this out. A good ball finding Godoy. Kept it short, and there Zuki is going to take a shot. But wow, that was over. Leonai, Perlasa down the right. Gets the cross, headed by Bauman. Seven players there right outside of the area for Barcelona. The ball, well, Carlos Rodriguez. Corner. I mean, Diaz takes it. Ball flies in. Headed kind of in the right direction. Studentes players feeling it. We're well over those three minutes. What a victory for Estudiantes de la Plata. 4-0 at home, and they move on to the round of 16 of the Copa Conmebol Sudamericana, eliminating Barcelona by a 5-2 aggregate. Three goals in the first half, the death 
of Los Terreros in this tournament. What a result for the Argentine club, and they are going to be a major threat going forward in the Sudamericana.